Now, the next challenge here comes from Epic Flying Oof, and he says, just do a simple ollie. Yo, what is going on everyone? Epic Flying Horse here. Welcome back to another Skate 3 video. Today we are going to be attempting your Skate 3 challenges that you have all submitted on my Discord. But first and foremost, I have to give a huge, huge shout out to two very important people, Sean Key and Neon the Baddie. Thank you both so, so much for purchasing my merch. That's right, you two are the first people to purchase my merchandise. Sean with the nice white hoodie and Neon with the black t-shirt. Yeah, they both look great. I hope they're comfortable. I hope you guys like them. Thank you both so, so much. And yeah, let's proceed with the video. So yeah, as I said, I'm doing your challenges for today. Um, this is gonna be a pretty fun video. I have a pretty stacked challenge lineup uh, ready to go. Um, if you guys all enjoy, be sure to slap that like button subscribe if you are new for more content in the future i think about 60 percent of you guys uh that aren't well that watch my videos aren't subscribed to me so if you guys would like to help me out and subscribe that means so much you guys can always choose at a later stage to unsubscribe you know by all means so why not just subscribe but yeah straight off the bat the first challenge is pretty interesting we got descender and he has basically given me a challenge uh manual across the entire map now i didn't understand the context here and i was just like wait you're talking like super ultra mega park no he literally meant an entire district i am at the observatory for a reason here if we go into the challenge map go over to locations go to university and go down to observatory you can see we're at the tippity top of the uh the district here the university district and you know what's at the bottom carbatron right and that is basically down the entire road uh here if we go down this road we'll end up at the carvatron from the observatory and well would you guess that it's from the top to bottom so that would be clearing the entire district this is pretty crazy i'm trying to think if there's anything in the way that will block me and i really can't think of anything so we might be all good to do this so yeah i think we should be good to go for this challenge it's, it's i don't know if it's gonna work uh this could be just a whole waste of time um if i don't get it first go i'm gonna have to do it another go and um yeah then complete it obviously so i know this road here leads to uh around the ditch and then leads to the the campus i think this one sort of leads pretty much straight through i think gosh I, I don't even know maybe they both lead there maybe we should just go down this one this one's big and it gives me a lot of room to i guess move around and stuff so yeah let's let's get this show on the road all right we're gonna count it from like once i start actually like going so we're just gonna go like now this is pretty much the start right now okay let's see hopefully we don't pick up too much speed here because i know there's a lot of downhill slope and i don't think we can afford to go very fast so this could be this could be very difficult um so far so good okay nice little uphill slope here i don't know if there's any uphill slopes i think we might be okay okay so far so good uh, manual distance oh there's something i should know as well i'm pretty sure when we're gonna end the manual distance uh, at some point i think as soon as you get air time it doesn't count towards a manual so we might be in a spot of bother there um but for the most part we should be able to manual the entirety of this this map which is kind of sick and here we go around the corner let's at least try to get to a, ma uh, like a manual distance of a thousand i reckon that'd be pretty sick because um yeah i think it cancels your manual as soon as you leave the ground so oh we got one with the dandy here manualing with me that's sick and there he goes okay Whew, off to a good start so far not going super quick but that would be the best way to go <laughs> and we are almost at a thousand manual distance damn we're almost at a thousand points and boom there it is a thousand and we're still going we are still going ladies and gentlemen holy crap okay i think this was the best way to go <laughs> Does this lead straight to the Carvatron? No, it doesn't. There's a road, right? Oh, what's going on here? No, no. Come on. I think I was pulling back too hard on the, the manual there. What is the world record for, for the longest manual? Am I going to beat it? <laughs> that would be pretty sick. But something tells me I'm not going to. Oh, no. I actually have no speed. I have no speed at all. What is the best way to go? Oh, we're at the top of the road top of the road surely 
this is all downhill from here right and i think i want to be on the right side i think the right side is uh pretty clear because i think that's the way the traffic goes i'm just guessing honestly we are still going 1500 manual distance this is insane and i think what i'm gonna do the end result will be just to touch like maybe the orange grounding at the carbatron you know like the track field or whatever so hopefully we get some downhill slopes here yeah. hey this looks like my old car i didn't have a red one that was white it looks pretty pretty close which is pretty interesting sorry for the boring content <laughs> i promise i'm trying my best here to oh no oh no oh my god what a thread that's insane okay 1800 coming up coming up on 2000 meters manual distance Phew. i see the points have stopped which um which is okay we don't need the points we got the distance this is just a slow and steady wins the race here oh my god all right and we're a we just passed 2000 meters holy crap and this is my longest manual for sure i've never done this before so yeah this is pretty cool oh no there's a parked car come on come on come on Whew. dude everything stresses me out because i've come so far now come on boy come on okay now we're picking up some pace now we got this come on yo can we get to 3,000 meters by the end of this surely and there it is the carvatron we made it now we have to be very very careful here because these cars will hit me okay just putting that out there all right and oh my god we did it a varial kickflip into a manual and boom there it is see that whole manual distance thing at the end there is what i was telling you about i was saying that like if you just get some air and then manual see like you'll see this it will go manual distance up the top or shit at least there it is manual distance then as soon as i ollie it just stops so i was still manually in the entire time i just had to do an ollie to get up over that curb but yeah I, I completed the challenge that was sick drop a thumbs up for that guys that was actually so sick that was easily my longest manual in this entire game right so we're on to challenge number two now this one was sent in from the kfc lord and he has challenged me to do a 1260 over the stadium shark <laughs> Uh, so let's head over to the stadium and get things set up. All right, we are at the stadium and we need to do a 1260 over the shark. Now, by the looks of things, he had ramps set up all the way over here. So we need to set up some ramps. Not really too sure how far to... Oh, I can't really see a thing, to be honest. What are we doing here? Uh, these ones? These will do? Fine, I guess. Might need to go here and um, put some more on this side because this could be very unpredictable. I actually don't know how I'm going to do this if it's actually a difficult challenge or it's easy so i don't know <laughs> i don't often do 1260s all right there we go i think we got a pretty good lineup here i think i don't know if that's good or not again i don't do 1260s very often boom and the final one over here there we go this looks pretty nice i feel like i could land on that to be honest white to the gap now we have to get to the top of the stadium i'm gonna show you guys a quick and easy tip on getting to the top of the stadium there are many ways on getting up there but i think this is the easiest way now you guys will be familiar with the super dude launch glitch right I, i'm pretty sure i put a video out on it a couple well, a few years back basically you do a no foot ear or a christ ear christ ear and then just before your feet are about to touch the ground you do a super dude in this exact location and over time at some point you will go flying and you'll see exactly when it happens boom there it is that was very fast and now we just simply glide on down to the top of the stadium um and yeah there we go we are we, we're, we're here <laughs> and we are perfectly in place let's let's finish this off nicely with a first try 1260 oh my god i'm actually like landing pretty well okay here we go Oh, we did 1080. Oh no! Right, so you guys will be need. Uh, you guys will need to know a little thing here that I'm doing. Um, I will do a 1080 clean, but in order to do the 1260, I have to do 
a bears to mute which is that now you can see there it tells me i'm doing a 180 or at least it did um if i do a 180 and then a bears to mute uh, i can't do it anymore <laughs> 180 oh god 180 bs to mute oh well hold up okay what i'm trying to say is the bs to mute simply allows you to do another 180 okay so i can like if i do that see that was a 180 but it counted as a 360 so that's what i'm saying i'm gonna be doing a 1080 clean here and then i'm going to be doing bs to mute and that'll get me my extra um my extra my extra 180 right so um yeah i'm just gonna have to get the 1080 first and then i'll do the best mute and we're fine now the thing about the best mute though is that it only seems to work a couple of times out of you know a certain amount like it doesn't work every time which sucks i don't get how it works perfectly um uh, i just do it every now and then and it manages to work so uh, let's let's see if we can get it now surely this is perfect oh i screwed up i did the finger flip instead of the best to mute oh why did that not count that's what i'm talking about i could be doing a 1080 or a 1260 and it's just the, the bs to mute doesn't want to work There it is, holy crap, the 1260. Uh, we'll play it back for you guys just to see what happens. So, um, that took a while, I'm not gonna lie. I was actually sitting there just in silence trying to get this thing to go. And uh, here we go, so we got the nice Ollie into the ramp. And there we go, the nice Ollie 1080. And then the, the best and mute at the end there just to get that extra 180. And there it is, the 1260, boys. That looks pretty sick. That's quite the gap, right? That's actually very far. Like, imagine doing this in real life. And boom, there it is. Perfect landing. Easy challenge. No stress. Uh, let's move on to the next one. Now, the next challenge here comes from Epic Flying Oof. And he says, just do a simple ollie. Now, this will not be an easy challenge. I don't think I've ever done this in the entirety of Skate 3. So, here we go. We're going to attempt it first go. Uh, wish me luck, boys. Well, it looks like I can't complete that challenge, guys. Uh, we're gonna have to move on to the next one. Uh, that's a real bummer. If you guys can do that, I'd love to see some videos. That's honestly the most difficult challenge I've ever seen. Right, the next one here comes from Scorpion in my Discord, and he says, Yo, I don't know if this is a good challenge, but Super Dude launch glitch off of a slanted roof and try to land on the clock tower. Now, we are in a perfect position for this, uh, challenge, because if we head on up here, you can do that Super Dude launch glitch that I was doing just before to get up on the stage like this and you can send yourself all the way over there so hopefully we can go as far as the clock tower this could be either very easy or very difficult so uh, yeah here we go now hopefully we can get lucky and send ourselves super far because um, we might need to this is quite a far far distance to travel especially with this glitch that's really unreliable it is very hard on this roof because it's actually the most slippery surface in this entire game. Like, I swear to God it is. Like, it's so bad. And this one, surely. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, we did it. Oh, we didn't go very far, though. We need to go way further. Right, I, I think I get an idea here. Like, on a downward slope like that. Oh, my God. And then now, now I glide. Surely we've done it. Oh, my God, we've done it. Oh, that was so good. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh my god, we're in the clock tower. What? That was just a guess that I could make that, and I actually did. Holy crap. Right, let's get a nice little second view on that. Holy crap, that's an insane launch. Yo, I'm busting these challenges out so well, I didn't actually think I would. Um, I always stress under pressure with all these challenges. But this is looking good so far. That was actually insane. <laughs> and we're on the clock tower. Oh my god. Please drop a like for that. That was actually so nuts. Also, while we're up on the stadium, we can complete another challenge, which is uh, from Epic Flying Pianist. And he says, I have a challenge for EFH. Quad back, uh, quad kick flip over the shark to a nolly pop backflip 180. That could be possible. We could probably do that. We may not need to be so high up here, so we might just shoot down here because um, we might have too much speed if we go from up there. So hopefully this is possible. 
Uh, we just need to land on the... Oh, we're going to Mongo push, aren't we? Okay, great. Hang on. We're going to swap. And here we go. Surely first go. I don't know how easy this is. Ah, uh, okay. Nolly popping could be a problem. We need a little bit more speed, though. So maybe... I don't think it was going to be possible if I was to go from the top of the stadium. Let's just... Um... Oh, I didn't even... Okay, hang on. This is a, <laughs> this is a problem. <laughs> Is that too much? That's too much gap. Right, okay, this is this is proving to be a problem. Oh no, I just did not pop 180. Oh, standard backflip. Damn it, that was actually super close. Right, we can do it. We just proved it. Alright. I need to get a bit of distance so I can actually uh do the nolly pop, but it's been a little little annoying here. Hey, we did it. That was sick. Oh, I didn't actually think I was going to do a 180. That was like a 360, wasn't it? I literally just did the same. I'm facing the same way. How does that even... I mean, I wouldn't even call that a 180, but it did count. It said it. Let's just have a little look here. That was sick. Oh my god. I, okay, it caught me off guard. I didn't think I did the nolly pop right, but apparently I did. Boom. Boom. Apparently it was a 180. So we're taking it. Challenge complete. Let's go. Right. I think that will conclude the challenge video for today. I hope you guys did enjoy that. That included a lot of the stadium. That was pretty crazy. Um, I thought the manual across the map was personally my favorite because I didn't think that was going to be possible. And then voila, it was. So that was pretty fun. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the challenges. And also thank you both uh, Sean and Betty for uh, purchasing my merchandise. That does mean a lot to me uh, to show that much support. And um, yeah, honestly, just thank, yeah, thank you guys so much. Yeah, if you guys enjoyed, slap that like button. Subscribe if you are new. Uh, I think about 60% of you guys that watch my content aren't actually subscribed. So if you'd like to, uh, that would mean a lot, honestly. And, um, you know, you can always unsubscribe at a later date if you don't feel like staying subscribed, you know. So you may as well subscribe now. If you guys want to submit some challenge videos, uh, challenges for me to do in the next challenge video, definitely uh, go into my Discord, go into Skate 3 Challenges text, cha uh, text channel thing and uh, leave your challenge. Preferably a video. Videos are great to look back on. Um, they're a lot to, um, yeah, they're a lot easier to make sense of what the challenge is if I can see you doing it yourself. So, yeah, definitely try to leave a video if you can. But if not, just, yeah, leave a comment. But yeah, it's been Epic Flying Horse, guys. I'll see each and every one of you guys in the next video. Peace the hell out.